finally we're at our first milestone and so our first project our first milestone project is gonna be a kaleidoscope so you may or may not know what a kaleidoscope is but basically it's a it's a type of toy or a gimmick which you use when you put your eye through it and you shine you shine it through uh, you look through objects and so forth and it provides a very unique vision with multiple colors and patterns that are pretty so our project is going to be something like a kaleidoscope but it's it's much simpler of course since it's our first milestone project so basically our first project is going to be like this when we run click the green flag button and it will draw out patterns like this so this is our first project so you have to make this program you have to utilize multiple uh, multiple sprites and duplicate them actually and move the x and y value according to the mouse but don't forget you have to do a little tweaking in order to make it have a little space in between the two lines or else it's just going to be a straight line so basically that's it you just have to make a kaleidoscope app or program that draws visuals like this and then when you click the space bar it will clear out the space all right so you can pause right here and try it for yourself before i provide a tutorial to make this uh, program and uh, i'll see you there, i'll see you there then so for the kaleidoscope project this is the final program as you can see uh, i'll go through by it step by step in a, in a in a bit but i want you to see the bigger picture so if you still want to try it on your own okay so basically it's going to have this uh, program pen down set the pen color and then move to according to the mouse like we've done before this and then of course the space bar clear program so the only difference is is this part you you use operator blocks so basically to allow for distance between two blocks eh, between two lines uh, you gotta like just for this one this is zero because this is the first sprite and the second one just plus five third one plus ten and then the fourth one plus fifteen so uh, you might be wondering do I have to copy each one and then paste it and then do that and that actually you don't need to do that you can just click here and duplicate that's it okay I'll go through by step by step uh, in a bit all right first and foremost to start our kaleidoscope project we go to control and of course we go to here when the green flag is clicked all right so then we go to pen set pen color and here you can choose any color you want okay this time i'll do blue okay and then uh, i'll put pen down and then next i'll i'll go to control and i go to forever all right go to motion motion and uh drag this block put it inside okay this is this is uh tr the tricky part okay so you take this operator block put it here and then another one for y position okay so uh back to sensing as we've done before this mouse x and then mouse y okay and then uh, before we put any value here, we just leave that out first. We go to control again, and we, when space key is pressed, clear the canvas. All right. So basically, now that we got the we got the basics covered, we got the, yep. Okay. So now we go to sprite, here. Right click it, and click duplicate. You can put as many sprites as you want, okay? So I'll put five this time. Okay. Okay, there's five sprites. All right. We go to sprite number one. And we know this is the initial sprite, so it won't matter if it's exactly the same position as the mouse. So we put zero and zero. And for the next one, we put five, five. 
and then for the next one we put five we put ten ten this is to ensure that there's like there's space in between the two uh, the two lines this one we put 15 15 and the last one 20 and 20 all right so we're all set click on run uh, as you can see okay click on the space bar and that's it that's our kaleidoscope program all right we're done for lesson 1.1 and now we'll move on to 1.2 uh, in the next video all right see you guys there